Hi, welcome to my YouTube channel. And today I'm going to be teaching you how to make a cake out of polymer clay. And the colors we'll be needing are pomegranate, which is a red color, so you can just have red. It doesn't really matter. White and Urku. You can use a different colors, but I just chose these colors because I'm making a strawberry type of cake. And you're gonna take your um red first and cut a slice off or just a piece off because you're going to be mixing this with just with just a tad of white you, because I don't really have a lighter um red it'd be good if you did and we're mostly just going to make circles and put them on top of each other and you'll be needing to freeze your clay because if you don't freeze it it's going to be like really soft and the colors just might blend together and it just won't be that good looking but anyway it doesn't matter that much but now you're just going to take your white well your urku sorry about that your urku cut two slices of the same size And roll them both into a ball. And you can rather roll the ball in the palm of your hands. Or on a table, but I just like rolling in the palm of my hands. And this is how they should look like. They don't have to be like a hundred percent um symmetrical, but yeah. So now you're just going to kind of flatten it. And make sure it's still rounded like so. Flatten it. Okay, now you're going to take your red and do the same thing. Cut a piece that's hopefully the same size. Roll into a ball. And then flatten it. If you can see, there's still like a white spot there, but it's okay. Put that on top of your urku, put the other urku on top of the red, and you're going to kind of squish it and roll the edges. So it forms a cake like shape. Now that it is like this, you're just going to take your white and roll it out. And I'm just going to use glue stick because I just can't find my rolling pin right now. My rolling pin. I said rolling pin. And you're pretty much just going to roll this out. And hopefully you can roll out so that the shape looks pretty good. And then you're going to peel it up and put it on top. And I know I made mine like too big, but it doesn't matter because this will act as the coat of frosting. And so you're just going to put it on. And make sure you cut all the excess off or else it'll just look weird. Okay, now that it is like this, you're just going to keep doing this until it looks like you want it to be. And this process might take a while because you want to like smooth it out and everything. Okay. I'm gonna roll it out. And 
So the bottom might look really ugly, but it's okay because it's the bottom unless you're going to show someone your bottom. So this is how it should look like right now. And you and now you're supposed to freeze it, but as I said, it's a lot easier, but I'm not going to freeze it. Okay, I'm just going to cut like a few of the slices off of it. So now it looks like this. A nice slice of cake. And you know, you can keep your other two slices of cake if you want to, but it doesn't necessarily matter. And I'm just going to take a tool and start fluffing it. You can use a needle tool, it doesn't really matter. But anyway, I hope you like this video, and I hope you make a cake someday. And I hope you have fun. Bye. And please comment and subscribe.